Hello hard workers! Today I will be showing you some very cute stationery that I bought. I hope you enjoy it! We will start off with these correction tapes. So this is how the box comes when it's packaged. It says strawberry milk and it says I love milk in it. I thought it was very cute. I got this from Amazon. The pack came with four of these correction tapes. This is an opened one I've been using. It came with chocolate milk, banana milk, and this strawberry milk, and obviously just the plain white milk. This is how it is open. It's just a normal cor correction tape. It works very well. It's very small and compact, so it fits in a lot of pencil cases. It's very light, and I love it. Adorable. Moving on. I got the holy grail of uh, pastel highlighters, the Mild Liner Creative Marker. These are very cute. You can see all the colors in it. it makes my notes look much nicer. They are double tipped. So you have this thick end here and a lighter, thinner tip here. I really like these liners. I love the colors. They are not too bright as to hurt my eyes and they make my notes look adorable. I also bought this from Amazon. So this is Kitten Mania. I bought these pens and this pencil case from Amazon. This is how they come. So you have little kitten heads on top. You get a set of five or six, I cannot remember, but they come together, but I gave some to my friends and um, one of the kittens had a gray head, but I only kept the two ones with these and this little brown one. Um, this is how it comes. You have pictures all over. You have the little paws, which are adorable. You have the kitten here and it says the cat story, a good luck wish for you. I really like the tip of this pen. It's very, very fine, but it's ink. And I love to write with the fine tip ink pens. So these are these. They're very good. However, I've noticed they run out pretty quickly but they're very adorable. This pencil case is pretty old. I did not buy it the same time I bought the rest of the stuff, so it's a bit dirty. I've scratched it a little bit. I really like it. It's very cute, and you can make it stand up. So you can make it stand up, then you open up your pouch, and then you, oh, you can see the pen marks as well here. I've not treated it well. Then you pull it down like so, and it becomes like a pencil stand. So, but since I'm lying it down, it's not clear. So it becomes like a pencil stand. So you stand it up like this, and your pens will hold and your ruler like that. So it can be used as either a pencil stand or just a pencil pouch. It's pretty big, so it fits in really long pens and pencils I have. So see, this is pretty big compared to my hand and it fits all the way in here. This is my Angelica pen. I actually think it's very cute. Um, every time you swipe, it says something else. So this says, don't be a baby. And then definitely talented. I don't care, this is my favorite one. I got this from Primark in Boston. I don't know if you have a Primark next to you or if it's still available. This was not part of the haul. So that is our kitten stationery done. Moving on to planners. This is a weekly planner I bought. It's from Lully Pulitzer, if I'm saying that's correctly. It comes with its pen and it's in a matching print to the rest of it. I just put it on my desk and it has the days of the week and then when you're done with it that week, you can actually just remove it. So they're stuck here and there's a nice pattern over here as well. Gold on this side. So it's gold from all other ends. It keeps me organized and I get to see what I have to do in the week right in front of me on my desk. It helps that it has a matching cute pen. Moving on to pencils, I got a set of scented pencils. The set came in five, but I'm just showing you two for now. You have a picture here, butterfly and a bee, and when you flip it, you get the scent that's supposed to be in the pencil. And it comes in this container, and you have five of them. So you open it up, it smells amazing just as you open it. And this is the pencil. You get a matching diagram here as the one you had on the head. So if you had a butterfly, you'll get butterflies drawn on here and it smells like sour apples. I've actually been using one of them quite a lot. Let me show you what it looks like. So I have been using this one, Jelly Bean, and look how short it's become from how much I've been using it. And the scent is still there. So 
I've been using it for quite a while. Every time I sharpen it, it still smells amazing. Every time I rub with it, it still smells very fruity and nice. I recommend these. And I also bought these from Amazon. You can share them with your friends, so you can get a set of five and each one of your friends can get one or your siblings, or you can keep all five for yourself like I did. This is the last thing I'm showing you from Amazon. It's this uh, note keeper or paper file. It says, keep smiling every time. It has little hearts on the smiley face. It's just a normal file. I really like it because I like pastel colors. They have a lot of other options. And from the inside, it's mint green, the tabs. So it's pink, pink button, and mint green tabs. I really love this file. I always get complimented on it. It's a bit plasticky, light plastic, so it's not very heavy. And it does not have anything to hold on to. So you have to hold it while you're walking around, grabbing it towards your chest, or just holding it in your hands. But you cannot just carry it by handle. I love this. This is a brand I discovered recently called Russell and Hazel. I chose to get this mini binder from their website. The color is not registering that well on camera, but it is a very blush pale pink lined by gold. This is the brand, it's called Russell and Hazel. So this is it. It is a very good quality binder. They also have normal size binders, so three, three hole binder with gold. This is the print on the inside. They have normal size binders as well, but I prefer this one personally. I think it's cute, small, and it fits in my bag very nicely and it's very light. Along with this binder from the same website, Russell and Hazel, I got this vegan leather pouch. It's gold and it has the strap. I will show you what's cool about it now. So it's very, very good quality. I love this pouch. And this is again the brand's name, Russell and Hazel, there it is. So what you do, this is the reason I actually got the mini binder, because I wanted to attach this pencil case to it. So you see this pouch over here, the strap, you just put it like this. And you attach it to your binder. So as you see, this is the strap of the pencil case, or the pencil pouch, and you close it, and it looks like that very nice very compact and you don't need to carry it separately you can never lose your pens that way another thing I bought from the same website which now I'm obsessed with to be fair is this gold pen did I really need this pen no I did not is it a bit overpriced yes it is but I really liked how sleek and the color is and how the the print it's just you do not get to see this very clearly from far away it's just like I don't know it looks like um futuristic classy pen it's very very heavy it is a very good quality pen i will give it that so this is the brand's name again russell and hazel and basically you just switch up the top you just swirl it around like that and again it's an ink pen it's fine tip i just got it to be uh to match the aesthetic and be bougie i really love this pen so it would just matches everything look at how cute everything looks Put your pen in there and you are good to go i got two more things from this brand i'm about to show you so i got these loose leaf papers with the blush border lining which i find very cute they have many colors from this and this comes in the size that matches my mini binder perfectly they also have the normal large size binders or let's say regular size because this is smaller than average so this is it you just open it up this encourages me to take cuter notes and more notes because i know they will uh, look very nice and there you go fits perfectly into my mini binder and looks adorable do you not agree so I'm about to show you the last thing I bought from this brand, which is uh, Russell and Hazel again. This is not sponsored, I wish, but obviously it wouldn't be sponsored. I don't have that many subscribers yet, yet. I can always hope for the best. So I got this mini notebook. As you can see, it's a bit reflective, sorry. But you see how it says mini notes, Russell and Hazel, and has this gold lining, and it's in a pink color. 
the, from the back. It comes with these three knobs attached to it. So it is made to attach within your mini binder. So if I love loose leaves paper, but I also like to change it up sometimes. And let's say I have a class, I will just take the notebook out. I don't need to take the whole binder. So I can write my notes in here and then attach it into my binder like so. So I would have, this is my binder. Let me do it this way. This is my binder, pencil pouch. I have my bold, I have my papers. Swiping through, swiping through. Oh, there you go. I find my notebook, my mini notebook. It's within that and it has a different lining compared to the, note, the loose leaf paper. That's it. And then we go back to the loose leaf paper that is lined in blush. So I think that is gorgeous personally and I, I haven't seen anything like it. I haven't seen an ability to attach a notebook in this. I do not know if they have this one in regular size because I think this is also another reason I was motivated to buy, the, to buy the mini rather than the regular size binder. But yeah, that's it. This is a pen holder I got from Pottery Barn Teens. I am in love with it. It is extremely good quality. This is glass and this is quite heavy, I don't know, metalware. It came very well packaged and it exactly met my expectations. I love the bunny ears. And this is how it looks from the back. So they're kind of curved on the inside. It's vintage style and you can put a lot of things in there. So you can put a makeup brushes, you can put cotton balls. You can put even straws because look at this. So when you choose to open it, you just flip up the bunny ears and the pens will kind of spread out. If I had more pens, you would see this effect better. And this is it. I'm about to fill it with more pens, hopefully. But this is it. I love it. It's very cute. And it gives a very whimsical style to the study space you're in. That is the end of my video. I hope you enjoyed watching. And if you end up buying any of these things, let me know. If you have any cute stationary websites that you suggest, let me know about them because I love buying stationary, especially cute ones like these. Good luck studying and see you later. Bye.